It was a legend no one who forgets. Everyone thought Koopa Fooper has left the Mushroom Kingdom. But then, the dungeons attack. Koopa Fooper is back with the biggest danger he's ever known. King Koopa. Using the ultimate superpowers, the Super Mario Brothers rescue Princess Peach and beat back the evil Koopa family. I'll get those plumbers! Hey guys, I found a spot that's really good. Do you think I should set up here? Yeah, where is it? Okay, right, it's at the living room in the um, MTFSS residence, so we're going to do the business set, alright? Okay, right. See you later. Yeah, I'm gonna set everything up. Okay. Mm. <sighs> Alright, let's go and get the sign. Okay, fellas, our new sign. Now, hopefully I'll be meeting up with Patrick and Spongebob later on, as business is gonna be blooming. So, uh, what are you gonna do with these meatballs? Well, um, we we'll have to freeze them in the freezer around here, otherwise there's gonna be a... Otherwise there's gonna be, a, like, a major problem around here with this meat. And, uh, unfortunately, you know how food poisoning goes. Okay, so how are you going to do that? Simple. Get a lid, close it up, and then put him in a freezer, just like that. <laughs> Mario, here's something very special for you around here. There's a bunch of characters that's just in line for, uh, like a fortune predicted or something. You don't mean the fortune teller is here. Indeed so. It's been a very long time since we've seen the fortune teller. I wonder what fortune I'm going to be. Okay, so that's a big humongous queue around down there. Yes, I'm afraid so, but I wonder if there's going to be enough queues around here. And hopefully there's going to be a fortune teller predicted very quickly. Let's hope the future is going to be good for me and Rosalina. Let's hope this will be a fantastic moment to our future. What can I do with a, an extended news report? I might even do a Mushroom Kingdom news channel. What do you think there, Fred? Um, we'll wait and see. We'll wait and see as it goes along. So, uh, what are you going to get on Fortune Predicted? Hold on a minute, Pikachu. Um, we still need to wait for Spongebob and Patrick, because um, I think they're up a late or something. How long are you going to be in there? It's nearly 10 minutes now. Yeah, I can't even wait to get a fortune protected around here. There's someone missing, isn't it? Fire Mario. Yes. Where is he? Um, I think he's gone, I think he's gone to check on with Zoe. He'll be there with her. Hey guys, we're here. I just came up to like to let you know that me and um, Zoe around down there um, were trying to think about bringing one of these Halloween sweets. Even though it's even though Halloween is over and things like that, just because Mimi Q took over, um, basically um, we just thought we might want to share one of these sweets around here after the fortune predicted and things like that for the future. I thought we might call this a Thanksgiving sweets. Thanks. Thanksgiving is only in America, not in the UK around here. Oh, come on, there's Thanksgiving sweets around here. What do we say? <sighs> All right. We'll, we'll deal with that one around here. We'll share some sweets. That's jolly good. Uh, Snoopy, where's Molly? She's gone for a night shift at Costa, but she'll be back around tomorrow around like nine o'clock. A night shift? Well, basically, a night shift is when you actually work until at least in the morning around here. So when you came home to when you came home in the morning, you feel absolutely tired. So you might as well go to bed or anything and that. That's correct, Mini Mario. Has the cute guy any smaller now? What's taking them to so long? Pikachu, yeah. Can we just go down to Rabbit Shed and? Rabbit would let us play on a Sega. Um, I think so, since it was taking so long for Spongebob and Patrick to come here. Hold on a minute, here they all are! <laughs> Sorry about that, Pooh. We were just, um little bit later around here. Turns out that turns out that the skylink was full, so we have to walk all the way down to the 
all the way down to Elvis Town, and then now we're here. Sorry about that. You should have come down ten minutes ago. I know. It's just hard. It's just harder trying to walk up to town around here. Plus, um, Patrick. Plus, um, Patrick has for got his bus pass around here. Sorry, brain dead. Okay, Pikachu, don't you think we should go first around here? Yeah, we might as well do that. Earn five pounds, please. Are you trying to take the mic? You've got to pay to get our fortune protected. So I have to wait ten minutes for you to arrive, and now you have to pay to get our fortune protected. This should be flipping free. Yeah, but you won't get any budget around here somehow. I think he knows profit. Budget is when you have loads of money. Ah, right. Yeah, I think you might be sub when he becomes your mortgage expert or something. Here we are, paid. So, what's the fortune then? Ah, let you just be patient around here. Let me touch the magical ball. Hmm, this looks like a square. I know because um, we can't even afford a proper ball around here and things like that. And plus, some people might hate Ozzy Osbourne. Oh, right. Your fortune is you will get married. Ooh, married to a fantastic girl. Ooh, who I'll be married to. You will get married to. Yeah, it will be your future wife. Um, Bob's a boy's name. Well, as you may have heard of it, you might be turned boy couples. You might become uh, like a loving relationships. That doesn't even make sense. Oh, that doesn't make sense around here to be a future wife around here. I think he might be telling lies. Ah, suck that. Dude, we're going. I just wanted to get our fortune protected around it. We're going. Okay. Well, I guess it's just me next. So, yeah, I wonder what happens if Santa was in town to ask them what they like for Christmas. And, um, hopefully there's going to be even more Christmassy than never around here. Ah, nuts. Hey, that's Charles Sword. Oh, hey Pikachu, what was the fortune? Oh, um, my fortune is I'm uh, gonna get married to someone called Bob. Ha! Is there anything funny about that mini Mario? Well, you're gonna get married to someone called Bob, and you do realize Bob's a boy's name. It could be a man. Just go away, Wario, please. Ah. Oh yeah, so you're gonna get married to a ban, so you're gonna become boy couple. Hopefully not. Hopefully the fortune thing is wrong. Oh, don't worry, it is wrong. Wait, how do you know about that? Well, he said something about a thousand pounds. Oh, I got a thousand pounds on debt. Ha! That's a lie around here. So, so I believe that um, Bobby is going to be become one of the fantastic women in the whole wide world for me. Yes. Thank goodness. Yes! Okay, that sounds odd. So, uh, what was the fortune then? Whoa. Let me touch one of those magical balls around here along the fortune. Um, that looks like our Tubbleware tub around here. Well, I was going to use a proper magical ball around here, but unfortunately, I was beginning to worry that everybody might hate Ozzy Osbourne. Nonsense. Kelly Osborne is teamed up with him around here. What's wrong with her? Whoops. I think I better watch CDUK properly. Anyways, let's touch that magical ball around here. Your fortune is that you'll become a spe very special guest on Bright Lunch. Really? Will I be cooking with Chef Crackers? Of course, Chef Crackers will love to cook with you. In fact, he's here right now. Hey, Donkey Kong. I thought it would be nice to work with me at the kitchen. I'm cooking pepperoni pasta bake. Oh cool! Pasta bake! Yes! I thought you might want to have that. 
I'll be cooking myself some honey later on. So Donkey Kong, what's our fortune? Well, I might be helping Chef Crackers on board lunch. Maybe this weekend. Fortune telling is uh, something like uh, a bit of a future around here. I think um, it might be a little bit of a fib around here, even though bright lunch might be might not last forever. Well, who knows? I'm gonna go and speak to the studio. Okay, that's a bit weird. Okay then, uh, what was our fortune? Well, basically. Let me touch one of the magical balls. Okay. I'm predicting your fortune. I'm predicting I have it! What is it? You will receive every single one of them on the DVDs and things like that from the Bible stories made by Hannah Barbara. That's pretty cool. Are we looking forward for tomorrow? Well, the future, of course. <laughs> okay, everybody. It's my turn. So... What's our fortune then? Okay. I'm predicting a fortune. I'm predicting a fortune. I'm predicting a fortune. I'm predicting a fortune. I have it. I literally have it. Snoopy. Yes, why is it? Okay, so what was our fortune? What on earth? There's no need to be afraid. Somebody call 999! Come with us, you're under arrest for touching that guy over there inappropriately. Every time! Why does it happen to me every single time? Do you reckon he'll come out from prison this time? He'll probably escape like he did last time. What? He escapes from prison? Yeah, every time. Okay, so... What's our fortune then? Well, you'll become an expert. A news reporter that will make you in charge for the Mushroom Kingdom news channel. Well, my wish is my command. Indeed it is. Woohoo! You are so lucky down there. Molly will be so proud of you, Snoopy. Thanks, Mr. Harris. Right, here's our fortune. I need to get my fortune protected around here. I already had a fortune for you, Mr. Harris. You'll become a honeymoon around here. Well, and you will go and live with your very own flat with Rosalina. That sounds really amazing. Maybe one day you might be having a family by having a baby. Does this mean I'm in charge around here? Not you, Grogu. Anything else? That's it. Alright. Before we head in over to the fortune teller around here, do you guys Want to get our fortune protected? Nah, we're alright, we're just watching you getting our fortune protected. Okay then, what about you, Yoshi? Um, I'll be alright around here. I'm just gonna go and join these two guys. Okay, you made me fall off. Um, alright then, um, me, Luigi, Peach, you're coming with us to get our fortune protected. Okay, Winnie the Pooh, what's our fortune? Okay, let me just toss you a magical box around here. I'm predicting your fortune. I bet you your fortune. I bet you your fortune. I have it! Okay then, what was our fortune? Please be a celebration. Your fortune in this box. Oh, oh my god! Oh my flipping god! I told you not to predict your fortune, Squid! What the flip? Well, this is what you flipping get, isn't it? No, 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 dude! I was planning to put your fortune around here! Squid! Why did you tell all this sign around here I was about to protect our fortune? You ruined it! What? You ruined it! That's a lie! Uh, wait, 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 what are you in the name of a lord? Squidward, why would you do that? Snap out of it, Mario, that doesn't even concern you. You lied and manipulate anybody as always. Wait, what? We had a deal! What was that? We had a deal. Yeah, what is it? Why you had a deal? We had a deal. You lived there. You didn't even bother anybody. You've been phoning SpongeBob and Patrick the whole time. Yeah, because I was one. Because I was wanting to do the business around it. We wanted to do our to want to do our fortunes around it. Because we haven't done it in a while yet. You two. You made me kick them two out around here, and I didn't even know that you're gonna do the business inside the MTFSS residence. 
Why have I done anything for a while around here? Anything about fortune predicted and anything like that? You just haven't done it for a while yet. Squidward, you just destroyed his very special it's ball a tub. around here. It's a tub. It's just a tubberware tub. And you have no respect for anything in here. You better stop it, Squidward. You better this is absolutely my wall. stop it around he here. He anger me. issues around here. You ain't even supposed to be here. Why are them two ain't even supposed to be here? You have no right to do this. Get out. What? Get out. Uh, 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 are you being serious? Yeah, I'm serious. You go too. You ain't even supposed to be here. What are you think you're doing around here? We've been working together. That's all, we have, that's all there is around here. We've been working together. Now get out. you got about 10 seconds. Start getting Spongebob. Come on, Spongebob. Let's just go home around here. Fortune Teller isn't, isn't a very perfect place to be put in this one. Ah, oh, come on, Pat. Oh, right away. And you can just sit here in your room and think about what you've done. Just because we wanted to make our fortune teller a little safer by doing the business in the living room doesn't mean you need to take it too. Oh, why do we just distract Winnie the Pooh? Something like that is very immature, very rude, and completely lacking in your maternity. Any questions? What's very immature and what's rude? We'll talk about it when you're older. Come on, Fire Mario. Let's get back into our kitchen and have some coffee. Sorry about all the mess I've been making around here. I just want the fortune teller to be returned. Oh, that's okay, Winnie the Pooh. No harm done. Besides, next time we do a fortune teller and things like that, um, try and do it while Squidward's on holiday. Don't worry about Squidward. Rabbit has a very serious talk with him. I know I can cheer you up around here. How about... How about you, how about some nice honey or something? That's a great idea. Uh, where's the honey? On the jam shelf. It's at the top where, um, all the vinegars and sauces and things like that. Just have a look. Okay then. I wonder how Rabbit gets on with Squidward. What do you think you're gonna do? Call him for the rest of a life? What? He's got to learn. Kick him out or something. You're not. Teach him anything. What I mean he's got to learn. You're not teaching him anything. He does what he wants. And then he gets away or anything like that. You teach him to destroy stuff. That's what he's doing. But all that business he does. It doesn't matter. I let him do that fortune with my permission. It was a special edition for Pooh. Oh yeah, you do not say a word about it, don't you? Well, you would have to know.